What's good YouTube? Back with another video today. Uh, today I'm going to be teaching you how to grow your social media as in Instagram. Now my Instagram is currently at 26,000 followers and a lot of people have been asking how do you uh, get more followers, get more interaction and stuff like that. I've got a few little steps to follow to start gaining new followers and get noticed then out there on the Instagram platform. So the first tip I'll give you on Instagram is have like a template or platform that you want to use. So now my whole page is just purely in the fitness category. So I post a lot of fitness, protein, workouts, etc. Now if you're in beauty, you want to post all in beauty. You sort of just zone into your own little category. You can post different photos as well, but it's good to have like a theme to your page because that way people really know what your page is about and what to expect in the future and in your current post. The second tip is hashtags. Using proper hashtags to your relevant images and theme, whether it be fitness, beauty, cars, lifestyle, anything like that, you want to use the popular hashtags for that. So you can go onto Google and search up popular hashtags for gym, beauty, fitness, um, anything like that and it will tell you exactly the popular hashtags. Now, you can also add your own personal hashtags into it. So if you have a brand like I do, Legends of Muscle, or my name, I normally hashtag Legends of Muscle or Jai Cassidy. So something like that really helps build your brand image up. So when someone searches your name on Instagram, you can find it easily with those hashtags. Step three is being active. So some people post once a day, I, like for myself, I post once a day, roughly around about the same time every day, just because you can sort of work out the highs and low peaks of when to post. There are a few applications online that you can search up to find that to help you out, but some of them do cost money. I post once a day. Some people would think oh, I can post once and then leave it for a week or a couple of days and then post again. You can do that, but then your followers aren't actually noticing you be active enough or sticking to like a schedule in posting. So a lot of the big accounts post normally daily or every second day or something like that to really start uh, getting into the heads of their followers to know when they post and when to expect a new image, video or anything like that up on their new page. Another tip is posting really good quality pictures. Now if you post up an image that's quite blurry and distorted or something like that, a lot of people won't interact with it because it's a dirty type of image. You want a clean, crisp image. You can add some effects, filters, different little things like that can help enhance your picture and really bring out the full potential of it. I like to edit my photos online sometimes before it. Sometimes my phone takes really good photos and it has, if you've got the latest iPhone, the depth effect to it and that blurs out the background all around me. And that really adds that uh, like depth of, in the photos that really connects with some people when viewing it off their phone. Now you can use some little applications uh, to correct your images or just blur out the background. So if you've got a pimple or anything, you can get rid of and that just really brings out the pictures. I don't classify that as Photoshop, I just classify that as creating the best image possible for your audience. Unless you're Photoshopping abs or making your chest or anything like that bigger in your photos, then that is classified Photoshop. But if that's what you're going for on your page, by all means go for it. Hopefully all of these tips help you out in the future for growing your Instagram. Be sure to check out mine at Jai Cassidy Fitness. I'll leave a link in the bio or to pop up right now and go check out all my other Instagrams as they've got a lot more followers and you can sort of see the theme I run with on each of them. As always, be sure to hit that like button if you enjoyed this video and be sure to subscribe. Thank you for watching. See you tomorrow.